Hello everyone, this is Julie and welcome to my vlog. This is my second vlog and in today's vlog, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be telling you how to become an assistant language teacher here in Japan, especially if you're from the Philippines. Without further ado, I'm gonna be telling you all the secrets, <laughs> all the process that I've been through in order to get here. So first is, of course, you have to be hired in order to get here, right? Supplies you on first na step. So first, mo ka sa workabroad.ph. Sign. Uh, you don't need to sign up in workabroad.ph. Just type it here. So wait, ako sa ni off no na ipakita na ako no ang um, nasa laptop kay. Kita kay ba mo char char sa tong cellphone? Wait sa. So go to workabroad.ph and you can see this this section in here where you, I mean where there is search jobs position agency. So, first is you type English teacher. No, we can listen to it. Sarah Kakamot. Uy, baya. And country, of course. Napadjuta dai kay. Kay butan ang mga tao. Tapos save. Dayun. Happy lang, di ba? Then, click ni muna. Lord, I can't hiring karun. So, this is my. This is my. Dani? Agency. Chasham Recruitment Incorporate, Incorporated and ni apply sa kudiri asa Bison Management na wala siya ayo dai as in <laughs> bias no pero wala siya ayo ayo magpagkaskas og time ana so go here English language teachers in Japan all right na nako ipadala na ang camera sa iya hang place para kita tong no okay hmm <laughs> First is that's what I did. I searched um, English teachers in Japan through Work Abroad at PH, and I've seen the this um, agency, Chasham Recruitment Agency, and Mejo Nakai Trust issues no with regards to illegal recruitment and all. So we searched dun ako ang ilahang ID na ni sila po P O E E P A P O E A license ID something, and I went to P O E A website to check if it was really registered, and it is really registered, thankfully. And so this. Um, agency is legit and yeah they helped me um, achieve my dream which is to become an English teacher here in Japan so ako ang basahon no kay kanang nakalimot na ko unsa ko mga gipang tanaw ato anyway so these are their main requirements first kai you should hold a BA or BSc diploma or equivalent in the education field. However, applicants holding a diploma in journalism, theater arts, mass communications, psychology, sociology, philosophy, humanities, liberal arts, and international relations will also have some exposure to teaching English may be also considered. So, kanang mga katunga courses ni ako ang mention if nakagraduate mo atong courses aside sa education nga course courses, kay pwede mo maka apply if na amoy English teaching experience, but if gani ang inyong course nga gigraduate kay nursing, engineering, business, media, advertising, hospitality, political science, even if naamoy mga naamoy mga postgraduate nga English language teaching certification or naamoy experience in English teaching, I'm sorry but it's a no for you. Di mo pwede maka-apply here. Sa kaning agency, okay? Maybe you can come here and have student visa and then apply through dispatch companies here in Japan, but um, it's gonna it's not gonna be easy. Kanika easier ni siya. Okay, and you must be living in the Philippines during the entire appli um, application. You also need to be an outstandingly fluent speaker of English. Dai, pero yung kabay, kabali kong English, dai. Chicken kani, di ba? Must speak with with a sustained neutralized accent. Kanika kanang kwan kasi sila ani strict kasi sila sa kailangan na juga neutralized accent today so every day day mami na juga TED talks para makakatun ka kanang kadungog ka pirang misa pronunciation di ba perfect akong pronunciation no pero basta interview day perfect kong ginapit day di ba para madawat jud ka day dayon must be able to commit to a full academic year contract mm unsa pa jud basta na mga char char ra ni day unsa kamo tanan must have no visible tattoos or piercing Tapos, tapat excellently, excellently, must be in excellent health and you should be very fit. Kay, dili mo, dili pwede mo apply if na nagalit mo eh, kanang history sa TB or hepatitis, hepatitis B or HIV. Even if wala na mo eh, ano, on a heal na mo, fully heal na mo, 
if you have a history and those kay dili mo pwede dai it's a no for you darling sorry jud kani jud okay oh mo ni kinaka ka nang char lang no must possess japanese language ability or commit to acquiring basic japanese language skills before departure to japan dai zero japanese when i come to japan when i came to japan the day kuni chu what gud ko nahibaw and dai na oi hi gozaimas arigato gozaimas ana da jud dai pero niingon ra ko dai nga kanang kada mo sa tamo story dai pa char char lang ta dai pero hindi memorize gud nako tanan dai no karon kay zero english gapon ko after almost 3 months that i'm zero english zero japanese gapon ko even after 3 months that i'm already here in japan but i'm planning charot to strengthen my japanese ability sa gamay lang gyud daymo para makasabot sa today and very important must be willing to drive a car in japan and be a competent and confident driver of a car as a condition of your employment so there are non um driving positions when you come here but um before mga departure that's when you know nga driving position ka or non driving position usually ako i my my so my contract and so ba i am in a driving position i drive going to my schools um so yes and some of my friends don't drive going to school pero kailangan jud ka na i driver's license kay um you will only know na driving position ka or non driving position ka maybe few weeks before you depart to Japan and you must be kind of competent in driving actually if you're a good driver in the Philippines sisim na kay nimo ining abot sa Japan kay disciplined man ang mga driver dai wala mo overtake nimo dai wala mo labang kalit wala mo bike skillid ana galit dai di pres pinas mo stick way kabalo ka lang drive pa ko nag practice ko pipitan ka dai ana galit dai diri is okay lang siya like dikli kayo ka mahadlok mo drive pero Wrong jud na no nga mo ingon ang mga tawo nga dako bitaw na ang road sa Japan no gag mai kailangan roads especially if na ka sa kanang ako na man ko sa medyo countryside nga area though i live in a city pero na ko sa medyo countryside nga area going to school dai magingat jud ka dai sa mga agianda kay pwede ka matagat sa kahumayan so even if kanang kuan kanang Japan ni siya no not everywhere nga dagko ilang road or wide ilang roads kay iskinito iskinito jud should do so dapat kapil ng jukamu drive and nakuit tip if you don't know how to drive yet first kay practice mag manual so after kay mag automatic na daimo kasi here in Japan kay automatic ang ilaha mga cars and if you know how to drive manual nya mag automatic ka sisim na kay day sumar na siya then you have to really be very honest in your driving ability if you don't really know how to drive then you have to you have to educate yourself because it's for you and the following will also be considered positively but are not required not required not required not required tesol t e f l l r s a or celta certification dili na required nga naka nangin anak thankfully wasa ka yung anak so go lang ta then a philippine professional teacher license dili ka nahanglan nga license teacher ka sa philippines to come here in japan oops me i am a professional licensed teacher in the philippines but i lost my prc id so i didn't declare that i'm a professional teacher in the philippines and i don't really it's not really me i mean i don't really need to use it anyway dayon strict application for zdr you have to um fill in a formatted resume dili ka maghimo-himo og resume dai na ay formatted resume ang Chesham just go to this um website info at chashamrecruitment.com.ph well anyway all of the things that i'm telling you nara gani siya sa website sa katong workabroad.ph just click Chesham recruitment agency sa katong ALT na hiring as in everything is in there ako lang mong gate so tn no kay boring kay no day off na ko basta monday so akong day off day saturday sunday monday day so karong basta monday wala ko buhaton so mag samok samok lang ko sa inyohang inyohang wall whatever anyway nara to dito attachment sa kanang sa downloaded form i mean ma download nga resume just download it and then fill in everything that you need to fill in there are also instructions there so doy uy grabe naman sad mo i explain pa jud ako instruction basta nara dito kaya ra gyud na ninyo Uy, nataga, nataga. Okay, nataga. Ako, you want to win? Sige, nataga, let's click the red one. Let's start, let's start. Pizza, ha? Iko kayo ba mo edit, so? Diretso, diretso, lagi din mo. Wala din mo edit, eh. Lapa, hiwi. Hiwi mo ako, hiwi. Nataga, hindi ko kayo ba? Bala na lang nag-hiwi. Uy, important yung information, di ba? Dayon, so, once you complete with everything, 
Let me hold it. Look sharp. Once you completed signing, I mean filling in the resume and all those stuff, you are now ready to pass it. <laughs> so imo siya ipas dahil ay sa imo lang ibilin sa imo hang folder, di ba? Imo siya ipas sa chasham. Same email and then in in I mean as soon as possible na makita to siya sa chasham and it's filled with all the information that they need to know or that they need to have then you will be given an orientation date so muna na siya no muna na ang second step the orientation date what happens in the orientation day even in kanang isa region ang place sa Chasham it's in Makati so i'm from Cebu and i really needed to fly to Makati just to attend the orientation and the interview so sa tinuod lang kalas dunig kwarta ang application pero worth it reach it say Anyway, so dito sa orientation, you'll just sit down for two hours and listen to the director. Tip, no using of cell phones during the orientation. Hala, uy, kanang, kung sa na, no, pero maagi ako'y mag-use ang cell phone. Like, dai, ano ka dai? Di ba dai, nag-interview na orientation ka dai na, mag-use ka yung cell phone sa yung atubangan, di ba? Change ka dai, like, kanang, kung sa'yo na, eh. Then, dapat matulog juga dai ha, kanang, magpariha ka na ako, magduka juga ko dai, kaya kanang, sige lang story yan walang ka joke joke wala serious joke dai like kailangan dai ma, ma masud sa imong utok tanan yung gisulti dai na pag humo niya gawin tuition tayo kalimot na gawin ko dai so kanan na yung di pang ingon so but anyway at least na ay mga di pang hatang ng mga notes you don't need to take notes because after the orientation they will give you all the notes that you need tayon so it was two hours after that kay nag lunch me no nag count yung daghan kay gutom juga kay dai two hours gutom ako dai eh kanan ba out siya ba anyway after lunch, we had an examination. Grabe kayong exam. I think 10 rato or 20 points na written exam. Dai, bright ba yung imong ate? Dai, na perfect na ko dai. Siyempre dai. Very easy ragyud siya. Especially if you know basic grammar, basic subject verb agreement, spelling. Hmm, easy peasy as in. So, wala ka na hinambog kayo. Basta grade 6 pati ngalik ka nung maka-answer ka. Pero ilang exam ko. Very easy jud. Then next is the essay. Tip on the essay, as always, um, katong essay, very easy. I think my question was, ay, nakalimut ako sa akong question. Basta ka nang, very easy, and just like the regular, um, the regular things that we like to see in an essay, though, like, it's in a sandwich form, start with something positive, and medyo, not medyo negative, but, like, a less, less nicer information about that thing, and then end with a positive. So, I think, ako ang dibtong question, ay, okay. my question was, the food you hate and the food you love. The food you hate and the food you like. Something like that. They're very easy to get di ba? So I put there, the things I love are seafood, blah, 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 blah. I can the food I love, kind of seafood, kind of, nga no, kind of, sa Cebu man good, is daghang mga seafoods, and then, barato lang, so maka-afford your to go, something like this, and that. Then, mga last negative, kind the food I hate, ba, yeah. Niinol ako nga, kind of, pero dili lang kayo ko ginahanag eel, because slimy siya. Pero ako gi-end ang um, ako ang essay with a thought na even if ang ana ang ilang mga texture, kay it's still nutritious and our body needs them. Charot lang, di ba day? Tapo kay kong score up ako nung hay. Ang bukit ka, joke kapit <laughs> But then yes, it's very easy. You don't have to worry about the, the interview and the orientation and the essay because it's so easy. And then, pero take note, I have someone with me sa orientation na wala kapasar. Abot. I think it was because of the test. But during the, the paper and pencil test, I was the one that 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 was the one Anyway, then after that, now said my accent test, they will just um let you read a paragraph. Then taro nga lang yung read dahil kanang pinachar lang yung dahil read dahil no, di naman kita perfect ng English no, pero kaya ichar yun na today. Ichar yun na today nga mo lang char today. Mo lang broadcaster today. Kaya to, I don't know today, confident good. Diba? Then after that, sino ito? After that, kay accent test and they will have like a little interview just about your scores and um where are you from where are you from a little thing about you why you want to go to Japan mga ana lang like dali kagali kanimo ma answer kanang mag more on personal ragud nga answers ang ilang need syempre let's quick answer sa silingan dai no mga jud dai dai yon 
after Anna is that when when they think that you can be a good candidate for the position they will be telling you they will be giving you a date on which on when you will come back to Makati and have the demonstration and the interview the demonstration and the interview happens in one day so yeah i was i was hired my my initial interview was was on june yeah it's a year ago june 23 2018 today is june 24 2018 it was a year ago motokong demonstration and um initial interview so i guess i told you like almost everything that i know about by the way i will suggest you to watch vlogs um in youtube especially kind of candy in the land of sushi teacher max or glades vlogs na andito mga information on how to become an alt in japan bali na lang din nag vlog mga in ani dai nya wala na ju kuling na syempre day off sa inyo hang mega dai diba nya wala na ju kuling na wala sa kuya sa apartment so diba ba lang ba so thank you for watching I hope you will really come to Japan. By the way, I decided to come here to Japan because kana galing ko sa Facebook ba nakita nyo na ko siya along the way no kana feel na ko toxic na ka akong life na feel na ko kay wala jud ko ni develop. Chung nag ino ay gyud kaday mga 2 AM thoughts ni Madai. Dayon day na gyud dito na ni agi ra siya sa kung feed day no kana. I want to wake up in a city where nobody knows me and I want to wake up in a city where I can like start a new life or something. So mura ko na char char ta charot ni. Buto din ang apply ko day. Oh, luckily after a year I'm here and I'm very happy. When I came to Japan, I had really good experiences. I met new people, new angels, and I've discovered some skills that I didn't thought that I have. Also, my workmates are very nice and my students are good. Pero na lang jud tayo mga problems mo student ti mga behavior no, pero ing ana man sa ta sa una. Nabawsan man jud ta no. So mga ing ana lang siya leg. My life here is awesome. I have three days off in a week and everything is really, really great in Japan. I hope that you will be inspired to come here. Maybe my next video will be about, will be all about, um, I think, um, what? I don't know, maybe the things that you need to pack before going to Japan. So I hope that um, to those who are watching this video, you will have the encouragement to do, um, apply in this position. And I hope to see you here in Japan. Bye!